hello world in this video i am going to show you how to add a settings for your custom module and how to store values in the settings so i have already created a modules named school and uh, here you can see under configuration i have added a menu settings which holds the settings of this custom module and i have also added a field which is message uh, let's see how I have added these settings uh, let's go to the code and uh, you can see we have two menus uh, one for configuration and one for settings and uh, let's uh, in for settings uh, I have added an action let's see the action here uh, the main thing to notice is the rest model uh, which is irs dot config dot settings and also the context we are passing the a context uh, which is cool uh, here uh, it is the data key which we are passing here better to be better to pass the module name okay I have passed the module name uh, here and here so, uh, uh, and uh, coming to the view uh, same thing the model is the rest.config.settings we just need to export uh, the class uh, settings and we need to uh, add the code inside that uh, this is the same for all uh, and what we are doing here is uh, we are passing a string score uh, which is uh, displayed here and uh, the data key I have mentioned uh, we are calling this over here uh, better to pass this as uh, the module name and this is the view uh, here the school management uh, it's displayed here and uh, this is as part of the view and uh, the label i have shown the label here and also the node describing the uh, field and the field which is displayed here so that's all about the view and the main part here is that uh, we just need to save the values into the field that's the main part uh, when coming to any settings so let's see how uh, is it saving the values here as you can see it is not saving uh, let's go into the models and check it out what's the problem here i have inherited the rest.config.settings uh, you can see the this is a transient model so it will not hold the data for long so what we are going to do we have two functions set values and get values the set values will invoke when we click on save and uh, the get values will invoke when uh, the views will get loaded so what we are going to do is uh, we are so, um, super the two functions and uh, we are uh, going to save the values into ir.config parameter table uh, since we cannot uh, since the rest.config.settings is a transient model we can't uh, the value will not hold there so we are saving the values in uh, ir.config parameter what we are going to do is uh, uh, we are saving the values in ir.config parameter with the key school.message and the value and uh, in the get values we will retrieving the value with the key school.message and we are updating it into the field message that's all we are doing so let's restart the service and check what will happen now I have already tried the values uh, before so this key already holds a value so that came here so let's try with another one mm, 
click on C and the value got saved. That's how we uh, we can uh, add a settings for the custom module and uh, we can save a values into the error stored config dot settings.